How's everybody doing? I'm the Catholic convert, and I'm just trying to find my place inside the Catholic Church. Happy Feast Day of St. Nicholas, everyone, December the 6th. Does that, anybody know the legend of St. Nicholas and the three daughters? Yeah. Well, in case you don't, most people do. I got the reading right here. Okay, let's get on to it. The legend of St. Nicholas. Long ago, in a far off land known today as Turkey, there was a boy named Nicholas. Nicholas was a person who created numerous miracles and accomplished many good deeds. As a teenager, Nicholas inherited a vast fortune, but he had no idea what to do with it. Wanting to help those fortunate, less fortunate than himself, Nicholas set out to make the wishes of others come true. While Nicholas knew the townspeople needed his help, he was also aware that they were very proud people. So Nicholas decided to help his friends secretly. Each night, Nicholas would disguise himself and deliver such items as food, clothing, and money to the people of his village. For all the townspeople, Nicholas felt the closest bond with one specific family. In this family, there were three daughters. Sadly, the family was very poor, and the father felt pain, much pain over the fact that he could not afford the wedding of each daughter. In his desire to help the family, Nicholas left a bag of gold on the father's doorstep as the wedding of the oldest daughter was near Upon discovering the money, the next morning the family was very happy. When it was time for the second daughter to get married, Nicholas again visited the family. He threw another bag of gold into the family's chimney. The family greatly appreciated the individual who was providing them with such a great fortune, but they had no idea as to who this person could be. As the third daughter's wedding neared, the father decided to stand guard so that he could identify the kind of person who created such happiness for the for his family. On his visit, Nicholas tossed a bag of gold through an open window. Upon hearing the bag of coins land on the floor, the father chased Nicholas until he caught up with him. Nicholas was embarrassed and did not want the father to make his identity known to the townspeople. The father promised to keep the secret, but was so grateful for the kindness of young Nicholas that he could not keep the secret, no matter how hard he tried. Soon the entire town knew that Nicholas was upon the person responsible for the wonderful events that had occurred in that town. Every December, Nicholas took it upon himself to reward all the boys and girls who had been good throughout the year by secretly delivering presents to them. All these years later, Nicholas is still remembered for his kindness, generosity, and undying love for the children. In honor of St. Nicholas, many countries throughout the world provide children with gift bags in December on St. Nicholas Day. I am the Catholic convert. God bless, and I hope you have a great St. Nicholas feast day. St. Nicholas, please pray for us.